Good morning lads and lassies, Coach Javi here and this weekend I'm actually headed off to complete a coaching course. Coach Javi's doing his uh, C license, his uh, United States Soccer Federation C license. So finished up the first week about two months ago and then uh, and now I have to go back and, and uh, finish up my testing phase. So basically all I have to do is run a training session and in two weeks they'll let me know whether Coach Javi is a tactical genius or an absolute Muppet. Nobody here yet. Coach Javi's an overachiever, likes to get here early. Last one to leave as well. Just kidding. Today's the day that I actually present my session. Um, I think I'm like fourth, there's like six people. And then I'll get my session over with and then I'll just be observing, helping out and just playing if they need any players for the rest of the session. But it should be about 20 minutes that I get to present my session. I'm working on preventing the counter attack. And um, I guess we'll see how it goes. Yeah, say say uh, say hi to the vlog, Lauren. I love this game. <laughs> what you got there, Lauren? Just a little yogurt. <laughs> So I'm done with my C license, got it out of the way. This weekend was literally just the assessment phase. All we had to do is go in there, run our training session. The instructors were not allowed to give us any feedback. We just have to wait two weeks to get our final grade and basically whether we passed or whether we failed. But I felt pretty comfortable. I've done that session plenty of times already. So I was relaxed, I didn't stress out. So I think I did pretty well. Um, unfortunately, they don't let you really record any of the sessions, so I just grabbed a few clips, but I couldn't actually show you guys the tactical components of it, which I would have liked to, but I got home, it was a long drive, it was about five hours, and I was planning on just going home, editing the vlog, and just finishing it there. It's a really nice day out, I want to go out, get some fitness in, so I decided to come to the park, film a little training session, a little bit less formal than usual. I'm not gonna go through any crazy details. Just gonna kinda show you guys the exercises. So we'll get straight into it and I'll see you guys in a little bit.
so a little bit less formal than my usual sessions it was more of just I just wanted to come out here get some touches do a little extra and um, also just film it so that you guys can have it in case you guys want to do the same thing when I do this everything I do with my left I try and do with my right if I can focused on touches simple stuff lots of corver exercises like usual it's always just lots of technical work so while I was at the coaching course since I figured you guys are always listening to me and you guys only ever see me in the vlogs and me in the videos and I'm the only one ever talking I figured it would be a great opportunity to get the point of view from different coaches to ask them questions to see what their thoughts are so that you guys can also have different points of view and it's not just me talking and only what I think so we were so busy I couldn't really vlog much um, we were on the field doing training sessions all day but I did ask them to answer one question for me so I asked about five or six of them what is the most valuable quality that you look for in a soccer player it could have been anything about technical work it could have been anything about personality I just wanted their thoughts their opinions just so I could share it with you guys and these are coaches from all over the country from different backgrounds they're coaching club they're coaching university they're coaching different soccer programs so I'm gonna put that here so you guys can see and then I'm gonna give you my response to that question as well after you watch the footage so let's go to the footage right now I believe a soccer player has to have passion he has to love the game he has to um, appreciate what he has and I think once you have the passion everything else comes easy because you're not gonna give up you're not gonna stop trying um, you're gonna continue to try because you love the game so it comes from inside you the most important thing I look for is uh, soccer IQ. Um, I like all my players to have a good understanding of the game. So when, I, when we work on things and practices, they, they understand where I'm coming from. The most important thing I look for in a soccer player is their decision-making ability on and off of the field, um, and just their general love for the game. So the most important thing that I look for in a soccer player is a two-footed player. Somebody who can use their left foot and right foot proficiently on the field and are comfortable using both. They're not going to avoid using that foot. In the game, there's so many situations where players today struggle because they can only use that one foot. So I, I'm really adamant that my players are comfortable using both feet. Um, work ethic for me. Um, it's really important that you're willing to uh, really just work on your game, every aspect of your game, all the time. I'm willing to improve. Um, that's the main thing I look for in the player. I say tenacity. I like players that have a good work rate, um, regardless of their position. Sometimes position specific attackers tend not to be too great defensively, defenders tend not to attack as much. I think a whole round player like that will do a job anywhere on the field for you. Um, and adaptability as well. So work rate and adaptability. Me personally, my philosophy is I'd rather take a player that I know will always give me 110% rather than maybe gifted or talented player that it blows hot and cold you know if I had to pick just one thing the most important thing it would have to be their decision making and I know I've talked about this before but soccer is played up here yes it's a physical game but the best soccer players in the world aren't the biggest they're not the strongest they're not the fastest they're the guys who up here their brain is working twice as fast as everybody else around them so that's my thoughts on the question Hope you guys like the response from all the other coaches. And um, I think this is where I'm gonna end the video for today. Sorry, but last thing guys, make sure you subscribe, make sure you hit that like button. I put in a lot, a lot of work to make all these videos with all the edits. It takes a long time after it's all said and done. It takes a while. So I would really appreciate it if you guys subscribed, if you guys shared uh, my channel or the videos with any of your friends. And, um, but that's it guys, I appreciate it. I'll talk to you guys soon, and um, we'll see you.